especially those who just love the piano. So this weekend is Carlson's Piano World Grand Opening. It's happening in Eden Prairie. This is really cool. West Metro, it is a five-day event. It's running through the weekend with special guests like the one that you are about to meet. Twin Cities Live reporter Kelly Hansen stopped by Carlson's a few days ago to meet the man behind the music. Meet Craig Knudsen. He is extraordinary on the piano. At the age of five, my parents brought me over to some family's friend's house, and I guess I just started hitting keys, and um, then just uh, started uh, the musical career just started there. I took lessons with my dad, and he quit after six weeks because I passed him up. And then, you know, so that's how that got started. <laughs> He's also a designer for Yamaha. My role at Yamaha has been very concentrated on getting non musicians involved with making music. Craig, this <laughs> is a stunning piano. This is what we know and love, right? The grand piano. This is the ultimate form. This is called the Yamaha CFX, it's a handmade acoustic piano. It's a lot of fun. Pianos are mechanical amplifiers. That's why the bigger the piano, the more dynamic range you get, and you really hear it in the low end. That's just an amazing sound. Now, if I did that on a regular upright piano, this part would sound very similar. But down here is where you really separate the, the technology. The gusto is yes, down there. Yes, absolutely. Speaking of gusto. If you move over from an acoustic piano to these other instruments I've got on the stage here, these are sort of combinations of this. For example, this is all the way at the other end. This is a fully digital piano. Wow. Even though I played that piano sound, check this out. I'm going to play the same thing. That's a digital piano. It doesn't have any strings, but it never needs to be tuned, and I can use a pair of headphones with it. And it sounds... It. It's a recording of that. But it gets way more digital than that. And there's a little thing I designed called follow lights uh, above the keys. Lights show you which notes to play, and if you don't play the right note, it waits until you do. Craig, I don't see any buttons. I see an iPad. Are you telling me this piano works with an iPad? <laughs> this thing is selling like crazy <laughs> because it's the only clavinova we've ever made that's operated either with an iPad, an iPhone in my case, or notice we put Android on there too. Really? Uh, basically, instead of pressing buttons, if I want to switch from Ooh. that CFX to a Bosendorfer, <gasps> I just swipe it like that and then I get that Bosendorfer sound. But check this out. Look at all these other voices that are in here. If I go, say, uh, to uh, how about guitars? Listen to this concert guitar. How <gasps> even when I release the pedal, hear the oh noise. my gosh! <laughs> Probably the coolest thing is this will teach you how to play a song. And I'm wondering, do you play the piano well, at all, Craig? You might call me a quitter. I, okay, I quit okay. playing piano many years ago. So Wait. hit the one that's blinking. Uh, you're caught on very quickly. The, little, the one higher oh, is oh, first. Oh, oh. There you go. And then the last one. <gasps> this is a song called Tenderly. I like how you're Wait. using two hands. Why don't you just use one hand for okay, now? Right, just the right. right. If you see a blue light, it's the black keys. There you go. There's a nice little turnaround for you. <laughs> now wait. If you don't hit anything, it's waiting for you. Now when you feel where it's right, there you go. There you go, all right? Or if Jurassic Park is more your speed. Go ahead and hit that first step oh. of the dinosaur. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> oh my god. You know, there you go. Very nice. Oh. Congratulations. <laughs> That's, isn't that fun? Yeah, so. Oh my gosh, my heart is racing. <laughs> Craig is passionate about music and the design that creates it. All of these pianos are on display for you to try at Carlson's Piano World. Their new location in Eden Prairie is now open. We've got one more piano that Craig wants to show me. Hit the play button. We're going to have Sarah McLaughlin play a song for you. This is <gasps> her playing the piano. If you look at the pedals, this is her pressing those pedals down there. Right? This is Sarah McLaughlin playing the piano, and this is her singing. What is happening? Watch this. Do me a favor. 
I want you to press a few finger taps and it will record everything you do. So play a couple notes. And then with your feet, wiggle the right pedal up and down, up and down. Okay. Now, we're going to play that back. And we're going to make sure we're going to look at the keys and then we're going to watch the pedal. So I'm going to hit the, oh, let's hit the play button right here. Hit play. Here's what you played. Now watch the pedal. This is what you did down there. Keep going. Come on. There it is. <laughs> <laughs> so do you know that with this technology, Elton John, played 301 pianos at the same time from the Disney Hyperion stage. When he pushed a key on that piano, if you had a disc clavier in your house, it went down at the same time. That was about five years ago. Really? Yeah, it's pretty crazy. Wow, I mean, well we were time. just ooing and aahing. Uh, that was a really interesting thing. We're that, just going, no way, I can't believe that it can do that. I mean, Elton John presses a, a, a key and then it was playing other people's pianos. That's amazing. It was all really, the Jurassic Park score Killer. That technology is really incredible, just coupled with like the beautiful history that is the and he's piano. He's so passionate about it. Which you is can really meet great. Craig. What a character! This Friday, October fifteenth, at Carlson's Piano World, he's going to be back on the Yamaha Clavinova to demonstrate just how easy it is to unlock your piano potential. You're going to find a link to RSVP on our website, TwinCitiesLive.com. I try.